Good morning, Hornets. It is so fantastic to see all of you this morning on this incredible Monday, the week six start and the last Monday before we go to Christmas break. It is so close, y'all. We are almost here, and I am so, so very excited. Um, Coro and Corral. If you have noticed, there is uh, nothing assigned for week six. Yeah, that's not me making a mistake. You have the week off from me. You need to uh, continue coming to your lessons, your individual lessons, um, on your Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, or Thursdays, whichever one. Um, but uh, yeah, there is nothing to do for us so that you can focus on your individual singing, um, but other uh, ways for you to catch up in your other classes. If you have anything for me that needs to be turned in, uh, please take this week to do that. So it's kind of a catch up week um, so that you can go into Christmas break feeling strong and feeling certain about your uh, classes and so that you can really take uh, the two weeks and enjoy life and time with your family. So that is my uh, Christmas present to you on this Monday. Um, it takes us to our thought of the day. Um, many of you wonder how I have energy, um, how I have so much um, happiness and excitement. Um, some of you are like, you're like the Energizer Bunny, but with more energy. And I think it all um, really boils down to my outlook on life. Uh, I am an optimist at heart, but I have a lot of realism in me as well. But the optimist part understands that life can be a bumpy road, but at least it is leading somewhere. We learn from our mistakes and our failures, and we're not afraid to fail again. We're not saying that life's easy at all. Life's tough. Life is super tough. Especially when you don't have enough coffee in the morning. But to react to that toughness is the choice that you have within you. Uh, I always tell my daughters, it's not what happened. It's how you react to that problem, right? We have to remember that your reaction is within your control. Your feelings, your thoughts, they are valid and they are real. But when they come out of your mouth or come onto your face, those are things that you can control. And leading sometimes in the negative can then bring others down as well. So having that positive outlook on life, knowing, man, this is hard, but what can we learn from it? And how can this make us stronger and better? That's kind of how I look at things. So hopefully this little uh, message helped you in some of the things that you're going through. Um, I'd love to talk to you about it. So feel free to uh, reach out. This entire week, I am so excited to catch up on all of the work that we've been doing. Uh, I get to catch up on all the podcasts, all the recordings, all everything. Um, I have been delinquent in that as I was prepping and getting the concert ready to go. So now I am in full speed ahead and many of you will see all of those grades be entered and uh, returned to you here very soon. Can't wait, Hornets. Just four days of the week left. Four, y'all. Four. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And Friday's a half day. So enjoy that. Um, take care, Hornets. As always, it is a great day to be an Enumclaw Hornet.